to our nation's flag. Sure, thank you. Is that on now? My first time. Uh, 
Yeah, I mean, I, I observed the meeting last last month. Uh, I recall the discussion, and there was uh, the. Supervisors had raised regarding an easement from Columbia Gas on the property, and there was some uncertainty on that. And we were asked to look into that. And we did, and we worked cooperatively with the developer. And uh, the uh, legal description for the easement was wrong, and uh, so uh, I think it's good that uh, the supervisors uh, asked us to look into it. Uh, there will be a uh, revised. Uh, easement that with the correct description that will not include any of the property that the uh, township owns and that is ready done agreed upon and will be recorded tomorrow in the uh, quarters office of washington county so as far as we're concerned uh, the matters cleared up and clean uh, should be uh, considered for a thank you joe did anything else Come up for no, all, the, all the engineering comments that I addressed. Yeah, I'm talk about that. Is there a motion to approve that uh, uh, site plan, that development plan for the dollar general? So moved. Second. moved. And seconded. Those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Motion carries. For resolution, resolution 043 2017. Um, yeah. There's next four for our road paving project for this coming uh, spring. Uh, the first one, 043, is for contract A, an amount of $321,285.50. Joe, can you please just list quickly the roads on contract A that are being impacted? Unless you have a chart, uh, uh, Bruce will put it up. No, no. Uh, we have a clear, clear road from Corporate Drive to Reserve Drive. We have Corporate Drive from South Point Boulevard to Limit, just above Clear Road, Blue Jay Drive from Henderson Road, Henderson Road, Oil Drive from, from Organza to Henderson, and Highland from Route 980 to uh, Profio Road. That's contract A. Is there a motion to um, make the award? I'll make that motion. It's good. Uh, Joe, what day were, were uh, bids open? They're open on the 27th of uh, February. All right, it's been moved. Is there a second? I second. It's been moved and seconded. Those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 The motion yeah. carries. And one, one statement, if I might. Um, this will receive an open on February 28th, is what the letter says. Yes. 27. I'm sorry, it was 28. Now, for 044 2017, it's for the uh, award of contract B. The amount of $159,845.80. Uh, contract B consists of Beach Street from Meese Bishop to uh, Meese Bishop Road, Short Street from Sycamore to Beach Street, Springcrest Drive from 12 Springcrest to Terminus, uh, some minor work on Hawn Road with some diagrail, Cowden Road, and Horizon View Drive from Rice, Rice Drive to Townstead Drive with some line strike. First, we have a motion. I'll make, make a motion. motion. And second, any comments? Yeah. Comments in regards to what's the minor work on Hon Road you discussed? We've got some, some guide rail work that we included in the um, in the contract, Eric. Uh, there was some work that Public Works did last year as part of their work to make improvements to Hon Road. And so uh, myself and the director have talked about the addition of some guide rail that would be included in the contract. That's what I'm calling minor work. There's no paving work being done on Mon yeah, Mon Road as part of this contract. That's the, uh, there was a safety audit mm -hmm. performed last year by uh, Gateway, and that was one of the recommendations in the safety audit was a uh, placement of guide rail over mm -hmm. the two locations over there. There's two, two uh, uh, pipe columns that you guide rail uh, placement over top of So is that near the little bridge or the, the small bridge? It's not the first bridge off of Georgetown, the second, and then the one further down near Maple Lane. Those are, those are twin uh, reinforced cement concrete pipe uh, calls. They need uh, guide rail placed over the top. So the minor work is just car rail and doesn't and have anything to do with Right, just that, that no yeah, place. No pain. That seems significant, sorry, that seems significantly lower than what we anticipated. Thank you. 
all the bids came in. So there's the, I think we talked, Bill, we talked about, there's the opportunity to add some additional Yes, we have a saving of about $140,000 under my cost estimate amongst the four contracts. Okay. So we could add some work to that contract if we so wish after we get Bill, are you looking at that? Pardon me? Are you looking at that for some additional? Well, we um, are. Okay. We are. I have a comment to make under my uh, public works uh, report okay. Okay. Uh, with regard to uh, one of the roads that's previously mentioned. Okay. So the turnpike may impact uh, Highland, and I'll mention in that in my report at that time. Right. So there's been a motion. One more thing. Um, so is there a reason for the numbers being down or the quotes getting aggressive? I, I think it's, uh, it's a tribute to us getting the bids out early. We're about, I think we're a month earlier this year than we were last year. And I think that really helps get us good prices. I mean, I've seen over the years of my experience that as the time goes on in the year, the bidder's contractor, their, their schedule gets full, and they just kind of throw numbers at it. I mean, I, I put jobs out in August at the last minute and just the bottom numbers that are much higher than my cost estimates because contractors have a schedule that's filled enough, they'll throw a number out and see if it sticks. So next year we'll try for January, right? If you, we, we yes, let's try. We may, you know, I, I do not, I've taken the bids uh, in the prior year, so you have a number for your budget. That's a good idea. On that too. This contract will hold that price all the way spring? <coughs> yes, I, yes, I had a, had a project for the Bridgeville Parking Authority a couple of years ago. We took the bids in the, in the fall with an uh, anticipated spring schedule. Okay. We have a motion and a second. Those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 The motion carries. For 045-2017 for contract C in the amount of $51,450. This is for the uh, single seal coat and uh, cap seal and fog seal on Grange Road from Propia to Village Run Road. That's the same uh, fiber and four seal? That's the next contract. Oh, that's the next. This, 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 this is the polymer. Modified. Like the pen drive uses. Yes, so we can six better. That's really held up well on our, yes. on our roads. It's really been great. Yes. First one, is there a motion uh, to approve contract C? Any motion? And a second? Second. Question. Go ahead. Um, Joe, why does Grange Road need work at the moment already? Well, we. we, we but it was, what, three years ago? It's about three or four years ago, we put. Uh, we put a binder and wearing service on it, and it's experienced cracking on it that, we, that the public work has been maintaining by filling the cracks each year. Uh, keep in mind that that road uh, had a lot of cracks and distress in it before we put the material on top of it. So we do have some reflective cracking that's coming up through it. Uh, attributed to the saving of the, uh, the cracks and the water out is attributed to the public works. Getting the silt that are the entire road will extend the life of that road. Okay. Thank you. Any other questions? Yeah, what, what is your definition of extending that road? I would say probably get another five to seven years out of it without having to do anything. I mean, silt cutting is a good method of maintaining the roads. Those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 The motion carries.